Less than three weeks before Russia goes to vote in presidential elections, President Vladimir Putin delivered his State of the Union, excuse me, State of the Nation address on Thursday. Putin's 19th such annual speech was nationally televised and even screened in some theaters. In his annual State of the Nation address, Putin spook, spoke on the war in Ukraine, Moscow's nuclear capabilities, the Russian economy, and relations with the West. The combat capabilities of the armed forces have increased manyfold. Our units have a firm grip on the initiative across a range of operational areas. They are confidently advancing to liberate more and more territories. They are talking about the possibility of sending NATO military contingents to Ukraine. We also have a weapon that can hit targets on their territory, and they should understand that. It does risk a conflict with nuclear weapons, which means the destruction of civilization. Don't they understand this or what? Russia is ready for dialogue with the United States on the issues of strategic stability. But I would like to say we are dealing with the state whose leadership are taking openly hostile actions against us. Are they seriously going to discuss strategic stability with us, while at the same time trying to deal us, as they say it themselves, a strategic defeat on the battlefield? The so-called West with its colonial habits, the habit of igniting national conflicts around the world, is not just trying to restrain our development. They want to bring discord to our home and weaken us from within.